video on three upcoming trends for the spring season. Just three really, really great upcoming trends that I'm very excited about and I kind of just want to share it with you and kind of get you guys excited about it too. So first I have really bright colors. Uh, not just bright colors, but bright accessories. And I'm really excited about this because I love bright accessories. I think they're really fun in the summer and spring months when it's hot out. It's fun to just have a pop of color and just something exciting to your outfit. So first I have an Essie nail polish and this is a neon bright, bright, bright neon pink. And this is actually my second bottle of it um, because I loved it so much. And this is called Pink Parka. Yeah, Pink Parka. And uh, this is about $8. I think SE colors are $8 and they're just really really great polishes and I love this color I don't know if it's out I know it came out with like a summer collection I think you can still find it next I have this great necklace and this is just like a nice beaded necklace this is from um, anthropology and the beads kind of just get bigger you've probably seen this on my mannequin before but this is really great with just like all black or all white it's just a really nice pop of color and it's just a really like cool touch to your outfit having this like really awesome necklace. Lastly for bright colors I have this great orange scarf. This is from American Eagle and I know scarves from there are in like the $20 range and I think orange is going to be a really really big color for the upcoming season. I just think that um, it hasn't been in in a while and I've been seeing it a lot lately on the runway. I love this scarf. I think it's just really easy and in the summertime with just like denim it looks really good. So definitely try and find some bright colored scarves. Okay, the next trend is like a global tribal trend and it has a lot of like deep colors like browns and blacks and uh, taupe colors and the basis is kind of just like khaki so first I have two necklaces that I actually made myself going to Michaels and getting your own beads and making your own necklaces is a really great alternative to buying necklaces so first I have this one which is just you know a, this is like as like tribal as you can get so that one's really great and then this one also is um, it kind of reminds me of Hawaii the like centerpiece reminds me of Hawaii and it has like a little punch of turquoise in it so that one's cute and I made both of those on my own I went and got my own beads my own string my own clasp and I made the whole necklace on my own then I also have this necklace and this is from Mexico they have a bunch of little like shops they have a bunch of different tribal esque looking things and uh, this is one of my favorite necklaces that I've ever gotten. It's really pretty with just like a white v-neck. I love wearing this and it totally, totally fits the tribal trend. Then I have these two rings which are kind of like carved gold rings and these are from Jewel Mint which I'm actually going to do a video on this website soon probably. It's just like carvings and those are, those are cool and these are uh, $29.99 and they were originally $109 so I think that was a really really great deal. Okay the last thing for my tribal trend is this kind of trench khaki coat. There it is and it kind of comes in it has the belt right here and then it has the uh, sleeves over here and this is kind of just like a utility looking type of jacket. I absolutely love this jacket with denim and uh, just a plain shirt underneath tied up. It looks really classy. I got that at Gap for $88 and I just think it's a staple in my wardrobe. Uh, I'll always wear it. I'll always have it and these are showing up a lot on the runway too. So these types of like utility jackets. Okay, the last trend is rocker. Kind of a lot of like lace and studs and red. Uh, I don't have anything red here, but you can if you like red nails, red nails, or just red accents in your outfit. First, I have a nail polish for this one as well. This is also an SE color. This one is called Over the Top, and it is just a black with silver shimmers in it. And this is really pretty whenever I want a deep black nail polish. I always go for this one. Then I have these lace gloves, and these are just a lot of fun for like dressing up and stuff. I got these on Shopbop, and I think they just like make an outfit. I have yet to wear them, but I will find a way to wear them one day. Um, they're just really cool. I love them. I'm not going to put it on this, but I just love them. Cool. And these are $28 on Shopbop. 
Lastly, I have my beloved rockerish Sam Edelman shoes. I showed these in my holiday outfits video, but I just thought I would show you again. They're just a black suede heel with crazy studs on the back. They're very high and they have the peep toe in the front. And these are such a great shoe for the rocker trend. I mean, this is as rocker as you can get. Uh, these are $199 from Bloomingdale's, but I'm sure you can find them online. They're Sam Edelman. And I just wanted to show you guys them again because I'm absolutely obsessed with them. They are so cool. So those are the three trends. And if you want more information, you can go down below, check the links out. And now I'm going to do an outfit of the day. So first, if you're wondering about my hair, I put it in like a really high bun. I copied Juicy Star 07's tutorial for like a top high bun. I'll put that below. Then on my nails, I have TZ Does It. I'm going to do a video on it. It's just like a maroonish black and I'm obsessed with it. It is such a cool color. It's from the Burlesque Collection. Then I have two nail two nails. Then I have two rings on. First is my new David Yurman one, which I'm absolutely in love with. It's just really pretty. Me and all my friends got this. And then I have a lucky gold ring from LF. And then my bracelets are CC Sky, Juicy Couture, House of Harlow from BB, and then two bracelets from Henry Bendel. My jacket is from Urban, and it's just this really cute floral vintage looking jacket. My top is by LA Made. My pendant necklace is from House of Harlow as well, and I got this at Kitson. And then I just have some black leggings on from Abercrombie, and my shoes are my Steve Madden cream combat boots. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you got some informative tips, and I will talk to you guys soon. Bye!